Hey guys, we are back with more Elden Ring. We are back in the Gelmer Hero's Grave, the video that started it all. I got some flack from some people for uh, not including the secret exit through the lava. I purposely didn't do that the first time because I wanted people to go through the kind of the main way to get the loot that was available. There's two armor sets, you know, if you drop down to the beams, you can still jump through the window. But let's go ahead and show everyone how to take the other exit, which does uh, have its own, you know, piece of gear that you can get. So fair enough. Uh, just like the other one, we're going to run past the first skeleton, just kill them if you need to, whatever, you know, take your time if you need to here. You don't have to rush through it like this. If you need to stop and kill the skeletons, by all means, do so. All you're going to do is just make sure that you get down to the very bottom of the first ramp, and before the chariot can kill you, you want to get into this alcove here, or one of these two alcoves, and get into the lava. Now, as soon as it leaves, jump out, and just start going. Obviously, you can uh, roll through here. Some people swear that you move faster by just... Jumping back, I timed it out. They're both pretty much the same. Neither one's going to make a huge difference to you. If you're going to survive one, you'll probably survive the other. So as long as you have the health or enough flask to get through here, that's all you need to do. You can also use the Bloodhound Step, Ash of War, if you have it to get through the lava fairly quick. But it does require FP, and it requires having the Ash of War, just FYI. There is a treasure chest. I have already gotten it, obviously. But there's a Ringed Finger in there, which is a unique hammer with a uh, unique special attack. Then you're just going to go back over here, get through this lava again. And there's a hole up here that you can drop down. Kind of drop to the left, land on this ledge, drop down here, and there you go. Voila, you are at the uh, end of the dungeon, basically. This door will be shut at first. Guys, there is no switch in this dungeon, okay? You can push this door open manually. Go through, go down the stairs, fight the boss. There you go, guys. There's the alternate and even faster exit through the Gelmer Hero's Grave, but you do miss out on the two other armor sets that you can get by doing it the other way. So check out that video if you need to, guys. Thanks for watching. If this helped you out at all, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, subscribe. Love you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.